Hello, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to withdraw from KuCoin to MetaMask. So the first thing I'd like you to do is to launch your KuCoin account. How do you get an account on KuCoin? Pretty much simple. Launch any browser of your choice. At the top corner, you're going to find the search bar of your browser. In there, type KuCoin.com. It's going to take you to the official website for KuCoin. Top right corner, you're going to find the sign up button. Click on that and then follow through with the on-screen prompts and processes to create your account so once you're done it's going to take you to this fantastic home page where you can now explore a lot of features to have a great and exciting time on kucoin now let's hop into today's tax which pretty much simple how to withdraw from kucoin to metamax from this home page check the top corner you're going to find a lot of subheadings a few subheadings representing diverse features but just head over to where you have the initials of your account name and then Oh, not that, sorry, where you have assets. Okay, so where you have assets, of course, you can see your drop down menu. All right, but then just ignore that and then just click on assets. It's going to take you to the window where you have an expanded feature of the asset or expanded view of assets. So here you go. Now head over to the left corner and click on withdraw. Because, of course, we want to withdraw and variable transfer so as you can see there's a restriction on my account because i've not completed my verification i'm going to show you how it's going to look like right here in this um win withdrawal window this is what you're going to find you're going to find exactly these the first thing which is yeah, where you're going to find the assets menu so if you're going to click on the assets that you have that you want to withdraw from and once you click on that, ensure that you have enough balance in that assets, okay, or in that coin. And then the next thing is wallet address. So right here in this um this bar or in this space. So go ahead and click on wallet address from this drop down menu. Click on this drop down icon and then click and then select MetaMax. So once you select MetaMax. Here in the wallet address, head over to your MetaMax account and then look for the wallet address for your MetaMax account. Copy it and paste it right here in this space. Then here you're going to have to select the network that you want to, you know, go through the process with. All right. And then here is where you have to gonna enter the amount that you want to withdraw you know from your balance you see here right here it, btc was chosen but this might not be your balance or your asset it might be usd or usdt whichever so here you're gonna have to enter the amount all right that you want to redraw and then add remax if you want to and then click on confirm now, after that, the next step is the security because you have to go through the security verification. So you're going to see this window where you're going to enter your trading password and you're going to enter your email verification code. So click on send code and then open up your email and then copy the code and paste here. And then here you're going to enter your Google verification code. If you have not bound your Google verification, you can click here and say switch to SMS verification and then you're going to send a code to your phone and you're going to enter it there that's if you don't have the google verification code and then click on submit so once you click on submit you see that the process will be completed okay so um that's it so there's some things that you need to note for withdrawers all right we will process your withdrawal within 30 minutes and then to enhance the security of assets we will draw amounts is larger than a certain amount we have to manually process your account and independence with blockchain when the assets are finally be transferred to your receiving wallet please double check your withdrawal address and token type if the withdrawal asset su um, succeeds as cool coin is no longer able to be cancelled and then different tokens different tokens charge different withdrawal fees and you can check the fee amount of the withdrawal page by searching that token after logging in and then this is this okay but that's just the person once you've sent some needs they're going to review it and then after reviewing the whole thing it's supposed to take time head over to your metamax account to see if the money has reflected so that's just the process you can go about this tutorial from top to bottom to get acquainted with the steps and once you're done you're good to go i hope this video might have helped you search